So your GPS won't work uh, on your Android device and you can't figure out why. You probably sent your phone back to the manufacturers, reset the software, blah, 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 done this, done that, and it doesn't work. Uh, my GPS stopped working. Um, couldn't get a lock, anything. Wouldn't even touch it. Um, I tried redoing the screws back in um, hard uh, uh, I tried software updates it's update, updated the, the latest firmware all that um, tried these apps to try and fix it nothing, no GPS whatsoever um, I looked on the net I looked on YouTube and nothing helped nothing helped at all um, so I was just sitting there and I actually had a look at all the apps that I had on there and I'm surprised actually how many wanted to to um, want the precise location from GPS I mean even a banking app what what the hell would a banking app need a GPS signal for oh well. so anyway I um, I uh, went to settings application and just started having going through me apps that once it needed the GPS. So I thought, well, it's not really a phone anymore. It's it's a computer. It's, so um, I started deleting the apps I didn't really need that actually use the GPS. What do you know? Now I've got GPS. It works. Um, it must be a thing with apps constantly updating, updating, and. For some reason, they've stopped each other work, stopped the GPS from working. Um, so what I actually did, I had 360 Panorama. I deleted that. Uh, now I, I didn't test it every time I've deleted. I just deleted a few apps. Uh, I deleted um, Westpac uh, banking. Um, uh, I deleted Navigon. Um, uh, Jeep. Uh, Satnav um, uh, and a few other apps and I went back and tried it sure enough I now I've got GPS so maybe that'll help you um, I hope it does if it does put down a comment if it worked on your phone put down your phone and say if it worked um, just to help other people um, if you liked the video give us a thumbs up see ya